Hello friends, this is Rahul. Let's simply learn robotic process automation with UiPath. In this video, we will see screen scrapping functionality of UiPath. We will see small demo where we will extract the text from command prompt application. Let's open UiPath Studio. Create a new process, command prompt, text extraction, create. Let's open the main workflow. Now we will create one sequence. So for that we will click on double click on sequence. Now our first activity would be to start process. So and we'll provide the path of the command prompt application. Where's CMD open file location? open file location yeah c window system 32 slash cmd dot exe this is the path of our command prompt application let's try to run it you can run from here as well or you can right click and test the, this activity as well yeah application is open now our next activity would be to maximize the command prompt window for that we will use attach window activity here we will indicate click on indicate window on screen and then select the command prompt application now in do section we will use another activity that is maximize window yeah let's test this save it run yes command prompt application gets open in maximize window now our next activity is type command that is we will type command ip config so for that we will use type into activity and we will send in double quote ip config now we will press enter key so for that we will use send hot key In this, we will see enter. Yeah. Save it. Let us till this part. Yeah. Now we will use screen scrapping. Here is one of the option available here. Screen scrapping. We will double click on screen scrapping and We have select command prompt application here. Let me show this again. Select screen scrapping and then select the application from where you ex want to extract the text. Yeah, when you clicked on that particular application, the text is complete text is getting extracted here in this particular section. Here we have used scrapping method as a native there are three methods in this uh, screen scrapping wizard native full text and ocr so here we will use native and click on finish <coughs> yeah so this is what the activities getting created and here one 
variable get created that is text where all the extracted text are present here uh, we will change the scope of this variable yeah so we have to change the scope of variable to sequence to use this variable in another activity now we will use one assign activity we will create one variable here out underscore string array we will create this type of array variable string array yeah so dot so here we will split whatever text is present in this variable as a new line so for that we will use what that variable which is generated cmd exe cmd exe window then dot split then environment dot new line dot to array yeah so we will put our extracted text into this particular variable out string array now let's use for each activity Yeah. So, so for each activity, first of all, we have to change the type of argument as in string because we are going to use our string array here. Yes. Then we will use if activity under for each loop where we will where we will provide a condition item. dot contains and in double quote our variable our text for that we want to extract yeah <clears throat> so in this condition first it will check item dot content ip origin for and then it will extract the text for that particular line we will use again one of one assign activity here and create one variable control k out value output value that output value variable would be string we will make it as a string now again we will split that value split item comma double colon one dot two string this command will help us to extract the text basically split the text from colon yeah now we will put one message box here to see the value let me see the scope of that variable 
yeah it is body we have to change to sequence to use it yeah out dot value yeah yeah so that's it uh, so far we will see execute and see the result save it run yes you can able to see uh, whatever ip address is present for ip version ipv4 address that is 196 which is present yes we will see uh, another value which is for default gateway let me copy this save this run it yes it has fetched the value for default gateway yeah yeah in this way you can fetch the text from command prompt application specific text from command prompt application this example again will help for to fetch the value from putty application as well yeah that's it in this video thanks for watching